Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel for part number seven of Let's Play The Sims 4 Get To Work. And as you guys can tell, we are here with Miss Candace. We are at her work. She went ahead and actually just got to work right now. Um, so she's just starting out her day. She wants to go ahead and chat with her coworkers. And actually, she just happens to want to become friends with Zoe. So let's go ahead and actually have her go ahead. Come over here. Looks like Zoe got a change of pace of work because I don't remember her being a actual assistant. I'm pretty sure we had someone else for the assistant last time. I'm not really sure. We should be getting a promotion today if we do well, unlike Mr. Devin last part, which really kind of irritated me, you guys. Like, I was so, so upset. We're going to go ahead and ask about her day. We're going to discuss work a little bit. Share brilliant ideas. And someone actually told me, I cannot remember who it was. Um, I think it was Andrew Cooper. I think that's what his name was. He actually told me what NSFW joke means. It actually means not suitable for work, you guys. I actually had no idea, but now I like want to tell it all the time to my people because that's so that's so cool. Like, it's so freaking cool. I had no idea. But we're going to go ahead and actually com uh, complain about our work because that's what we want to do right now. I'm pretty sure we all can feel I mean, right in front of the nurse, too. Like, technically, he's our boss. <laughs> but I mean, and we have to go ahead and deliver food. Devin's off to work. Cool. Good for you. Hopefully, you get a promotion today, which would be amazing. Um, but we're going to go ahead and com complain about work. Um, we're going to have to go ahead and deliver some food real quick um, so we don't get, like, a complete... <laughs> Utterly disaster of a day. We're gonna chat with coworkers. Okay, fine. Go with that. We're gonna go ahead and get to know. Actually, oh, it looks like there's a patient here. It's not our job yet. We'll find out later, but we're gonna go ahead and talk to Adrian real quick, too. We're gonna joke about coworkers. She's a goofball, which we all kind of knew that Zoe was a goofball. We've seen her plenty of times in this Let's Play. But let's go ahead and actually deliver some food. Oh, it looks like we have a sick boy here today. His name is Ign Ignacio Lane. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and actually deliver some food to him. Because that's what we need to do. We need to have a cup of coffee and discuss work. We can do that later. For right now, let's take care of some of our patients a little bit. Miss Thang. Oh, yeah. I, hi, Candace. We see you. We know you're here. Don't worry. Uh, she's going to go ahead and deliver some food to Ignacio. Ignacio? Ignacio? Go ahead and give him some food. He looks so miserable. Oh, poor thing. Poor kid. Okay, let's see what else we have to do. Okay, so we need to mop up a puddle. Um, I'm not sure where they are. I'm guessing they're right here. Why not? Oh, there's some more kids and a lady here. Like, did our room is expand? I feel like we have more rooms, but oh, looks like no one else is here. I don't know where they came from. They showed up out of nowhere. We're going to go and mop up the puddle. We're not going to clean up the whole freaking place. That is not our job. <laughs> and there goes the air. So I apologize for all of the background noise. I am so freaking sorry, you guys. I'm tr just waiting for that graphics card to get, um, just waiting for that graphics card to get here so I can go ahead and actually, uh, what was that? Uh, evilness? Oh, there's an evil sim in this town. I don't know why, but we're going to go ahead and grab a cup of coffee. That should go ahead and fix that for us. Cool. We're at a silver, si silver, silver metal. Um, let's go ahead and make up a bed real quick. Um, object doesn't need cleaning. Um, that doesn't need cleaning. Um, this one needs cleaning, right? Yeah, let's go ahead and make up the bed. Uh, you're not going to view anything right now. Um, oh, the coffee was gross. Yeah, we need a new coffee maker for this place. And we can't build anything either. You can't modify it a lot while your sim is working. I mean, I guess if it was... No, stop, talk, stop viewing that. Um, I guess if it was like if we came to have a baby... It would do that. But let's go ahead and make the bed. Perfect. We should get like a easy, easy promotion. We need to wash our hands again. Go ahead and do that once. And you need to research health reports. Um. Okay. So there's Judy Smart. What happened to Zoe? Where did my girl Zoe go? Did she go home for the day? There should be no reason why she should go home. It's freaking. She's working. There is no way. Is she here though? Can we just see if she's here? Uh, Zoe. She's here. I'm pretty sure she's here. Let's pause it. Let's see where she's at. Zoe, where are you? Zoe? Zoe, are you here? Zoe? Zoe? Woohoo! Come here. We need you. Where are you? I guess you're not here anymore. Oh well. Uh, she wants to get a promotion, right? 
Yeah, she wants to get a promotion. Um, let's go ahead and meet Judy. We have no idea who Judy is. Uh, she's like a random all of a sudden. Now she's our assistant. Pff, please. Oh, and you're going to get up from your job. Cool. I mean, obviously, you're not taking in patients for some reason. I have no idea why that is. I mean, that's like the one job you have, right? And you still can't even. And you're coming all the way in here. Like, bro, we did not come, need to come in here to have a group conversation. We need to discuss work. Um, we'll go ahead and discuss work with Judy. I mean, we have no idea who Judy is. I mean, obviously she's replacing Zoe, but we're gonna praise her, her work ethic. Why not? I, I kind of want to pretend to fire her, but I don't think we'll do that right now. Um, let's go ahead and get to know her a little bit. I don't know if that was actually a part of it. I don't know, but it looks like he's coming in here. Um, are you gonna take care of her? Please, thank you for actually taking care of. You a patient like that's awesome um so what we need to do is research online stuff let's go ahead and go in here into the computer um let's go ahead and research health reports we already did it earlier this morning before work we can always do it again no rush right so looks like we don't actually have to stay late because we actually we've got like this under control but i want zoe to like be here i don't know where she's at she should be working today I have no idea why she's not here though. Yeah, texting while on the job. That's how we work in this game. Um, is she here yet? Nope, and there's just a bunch of sick patients. Sooner or later, we'll go ahead and get to actually being able to do that. But for right now, there's no real reason for us to do that. It's not in our job description just of now. But let's go ahead, we need to mop, mop another puddle. We'll go ahead and do this one. And then we'll go ahead and wash our hands again and chat with more coworkers. I really want to talk to Zoe, but for some reason, Zoe's not here and Judy just had to come in because she's not doing her job. Like, for some reason, I don't know why. I love how they get rid of someone who's not doing their job for someone who's not doing their job. Like, yeah, let's get it much better right now. Um, I wish freaking Zoe was here still. I don't know why. I love how there's a computer right here. Okay, so we mopped up a little. No need to do more. No need to do more. We need to chat with a patient. Let's go and talk to Ignacio because he's all here by himself. Let's do a funny introduction. We could probably diagnose him and send him home. Like, right? Why not? Um, he is not feeling good. He's feeling uncomfortable. Poor little Ignacio. He's being totally ignored. Everybody's back there talking to that little girl. Like, you have another little boy up here. Yeah, he doesn't have, like, a disease on him. But you know what? Like... You can still talk to him. Let's ask him about his day. See how his day's going. We need to make another bed. Not right now. Um, we'll do an impression. Try to make him feel better. Because you know he's not feeling good. We'll try to just make him be in a better mood a little bit. I'm a cartoon character. And he did not like that. I, ap I apologize. I did not know I was such an inconvenience for you. Uh, let's go ahead and try to treat him. Because why not? Um, we'll discuss general health. He's already had his temperature taking it looks like, so there's really nothing to worry about there. But since he's being ignored, why not take it upon ourselves to actually help him? Ooh. Looks like he has something going on with his head. If you saw, like, the auras coming off right there, I'm not really sure. But we'll discuss our general health. See what we can do. See if we can treat him a little bit. Um, go ahead and treat him. I'm pretty sure he has a bloaty head. And I guess we're taking a shot. I want to get a picture of this. Oh, oh, poor little Ignacio. He feels so bad. He feels so bad for this kid. But let's go ahead and take a nice little picture. Nothing to be scared of. It's just a shot. It doesn't hurt or anything. I freaking love these. I love the interactions that they have for this stuff. It's so freaking cool to see. Perfect. All better. He is cured. Ignacio is successfully cured. He's going on home. Oh, we're going to go ahead and make his bed. That's mainly why we treated him, is so I can get this one done and make his bed a little bit. That's really the only reason why I did that. And we need to talk with coworkers. Zoe's still not here. These people are just lining up at the door. Let's talk to Judy. Share brilliant ideas. Why not? Um, tell him not suitable for work joke. Um, let's go ahead and gossip a little bit. Then we'll go ahead and talk to Mr. <laughs> Adrian ways. Let's go ahead and dismiss his evil ways. Let's see if we can cure him of being evil. Um, and then maybe we'll go ahead and go out with Zoe a little bit after work. 
Um, mainly because we want to get to know her a little bit. Um, this dismiss evil ways. We're not going to do that right now. Um, we want to discuss work. Um, let's go ahead and... Um, uh, discuss work. We do a group interaction, I guess. Why not? We should be getting this promotion here in about five minutes, 36 minutes, I'm saying. But she has to use the bathroom. We'll go ahead and send her over here real quick to use the actual bathroom. Use it. Stop talking. Get yourself feeling good. And we'll probably send her and... Um... Stop. No, go use the bathroom. You need to use the bathroom before you go home. From work. I can't believe we go to work at freaking 3 p.m. Like, you work from 7 to 3, and it's so easy to get promotion. You guys, stop talking. I need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> go to the bathroom, please. Okay, I guess not. But it looks like Candace did a fantastic job today. Promotions and community health are surely in the future. Candace has been promoted to orderly. Yes! Um, we can now make an additional $5 per hour for a grand total of $23 per hour. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Um, she also received the following bonus of $192. New clothes, Dr. Xavier Ray's display. Don't know what that is. Probably going to go see what that is. And then a not so blind chart. Her next shift will be Saturday at 7 a.m. And she made $188 today she's home now all by herself we're gonna go ahead and have her use the bathroom get herself all ready and then we'll go ahead and send her out with zoe um i don't know where we're gonna go but they want to become friends so we'll probably go to like the park or somewhere cool she wants to buy a microphone stand you're not a comedian believe me you may have your funny doctor jokes but you're still not a comedian just so you know and we actually have to take a shower too before we go out gotta, gotta be smelling good gotta be on the fly to go out right now. Um, blah, 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 blah. Then we'll go ahead and actually invite Zoe out. We'll see if she's not busy or not. Go ahead and travel with Zoe Patel. Um, and let's find out where we can go. I mean, they both work at the doctor. I mean, there's nowhere we can go for the doctor. I wish we can go ahead and visit like the hospital and everything without being at work. I don't know if it's even possible or not, but um it'd be cool maybe we'll go ahead and go to uh, it's always busy right now she ain't at work she ain't doing nothing crazy she ain't being crazy i guess we're not traveling then can we invite her to come over is that possible um invite to hang out a current lot Let's see come on you are not busy you do not you're not busy oh you work until seven oh i had no idea so i guess we're gonna have to wait until you actually get home so let's go ahead and serve some dinner then. We'll do some franken beans. Why not? Get everybody ready for when they come home. And she wants to tell a joke because she's so funny with her microphone stand that she wants to buy. She wants to tell a joke. Please. You are not that funny. You may be funny with your fellow doctors, but that don't mean everybody's going to get your not suitable for work jokes. Believe you and me. Okay, so she's getting a little hungry. Um, oh, look at that, you guys. So Devin is back home from work. He's been promoted to officer. He now makes an additional $8 per hour for a grand total of $30. He's received the following bonus of $160 and new clothes. The next shift is Saturday at 8 a.m. And she earned a level two of cooking. How exciting. He does a better job when he's not home with us than we are with him, which is very sad. And he actually wants to go ahead and chat with Don. Hmm. Very crazy. We can actually go ahead and call him up. Um, I guess you want to be friends with him. I mean, there's nothing really wrong with that, but... Oh, look at these two siblings there. They look so much alike. I mean, they were generated from Greatest Sim together. So it does make sense that they do look alike. There she is, talking about video games. I mean, it's, he's a boy. He likes video games, right? <laughs> Everybody does. Um, click to expand. Embarrassed from work. Sometimes a person can't help but make a fool of themselves in front of all their coworkers. I guess you should be getting a freaking promotion too, right? Uh, no, because you need another breakthrough. And she actually had her third breakthrough off camera, I think. I think. Yeah, she had an off she had her third breakthrough breakthrough off camera, so she can now go ahead and make the sim ray, which is like a freeze ray. I think is the one she can create right now. Go ahead and finish your food. Go ahead and clean up a little bit. Devin, what can you do? 
Uh, for work, what do you need? You need to go on patrol. You need to go to... You went to a crime scene? You, might, you had to have done that today. Going to a crime scene. Zoe should be out of work here in a minute. Go ahead and clean up your food, please. And then go ahead and put this away in the fridge. Um, because I don't know... As soon as Zoe comes home from work, we'll go ahead and just hook up with her there and do whatever we have to do. She wants to tell a joke. Um, why don't we go ahead and tell a knock-knock joke? <laughs> Miss, I'm so funny. And you broke the freaking sink. Ah, uh, Devin. Devin to the rescue. Manly man in the house. Go ahead and repair our sink for us. We don't want to spend the money. We don't have the money to spend on a new thing. We can actually probably open a store, too. I don't know, though. Um, but we're going to go ahead and ask Zoe out. She should be right here. Bam. Lily came out with $288. She did not get a uh, promotion, mainly because, you know why? <gasps> she doesn't have a breakthrough. So let's go ahead and actually read something, and then we'll have Miss Thing. Um, go ahead and travel with. We'll do the phone. Um, travel, travel with Miss Zoe Patel. Does it working? Is she busy? Let's see. Hopefully not. She's off of work. Oh, she's going with us. Cool. Awesome. Candace, we'll see you there. We're, we are Candace. What are you talking about? We'll see you there. Um, should we go work out a little bit? Should we go to the nightclub? Let's go ahead and go to the Blue Velvet nightclub. Go have a girls' night out. Why not? See if we can become friends with Zoe because that's what she wants to do, right? Why not go ahead and become friends with her then? And we have, we probably have like 10 minutes left on this part too, which is freaking amazing. It feels like time's freaking flying by though in this part though. So crazy. Oh my gosh, my nose itches so bad. Ugh. I should be able to wake up early tomorrow because I freaking slept all the way until 3 p.m. today. And it's now 3 a.m. So I've only been up for 12 hours, you guys. Um, but I literally slept all damn day today. And it's Easter Sunday of me filming this. Well, now Monday. But, ooh, Jay Huntington is here. Oh, hello, Mr. Jay. How are you? I freaking love you. Um, let's go ahead and uh, um, discuss our interests. Let's go ahead and complain about work. Or, I don't know. Discuss world peace. Um, and my air finally turned off. Thank God. So you guys don't have to listen to that insane freaking noise in the back. God, it irritates me when I hear that. Because I can hear it over my game like in playing it because it's right outside my door. Go ahead and discuss work a little bit. Uh, share brilliant ideas. Um, reveal a brilliant invention even though we're not a scientist. Go ahead and hug her. Um, ask about her day because we only saw her for like the first half of work. I don't know where she went after that, but... Let's go ahead and speed through this. Looks like Malcolm Landgrab is here too. Or no, that's Jeffrey Landgrab. Malcolm's the son. Jeffrey is his father. Um, what do you want to do? You want to go ahead and try to calm yourself down? You're freaking tense. Like, unchallenged? You're talking to this girl. Like, you are challenged enough. Like, see, you're talking about your stuff. Like, you're talking about your fun scientist-like stuff. Go ahead and compliment her outfit. We are fashion forward. We became friends with freaking Zoe. You want to be funny with Zoe? Um, is she telling a joke yet? No, she's complimenting her outfit. Um, a joke about politicians. They're funny, right? I mean, I know nothing about politics, but they're funny, right? Oh, who are you? Who are you walking around in this kind of dress? Like, you are you getting married right now? Everly Van? Are you getting married? Oh, damn. This place is popping tonight. Mr. J is here. Oh, we got we got some Ray Ranches. We got some Javon Rikavumar Hulawada. I don't know what his last name is. But let's go ahead and get a drink with um Ooh, ooh, well who 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 are you, Mr. Bartender? Well hello to you, um, Mr. D'Angelo Mai. <sighs> Drake Halbert? No, you're not cute. Uh Travis Scott, he's in my he was in my current household. I don't play with them anymore. Um, who else is here? Xavier, Eric Lewis, Ray Ranches, uh, Blake Hensley. Blake Hensley's here too. Jay Huntington. Oh, well, hello, Jay Huntington. And who are you? Who are you, dude? Jay Von... Oh, that's Ruka Lavar. That's Ruka Lavar. Let's go ahead and talk to him. I like his name. I like his name, so let's go talk to him. Why not, right? I like his name, and he's probably a cute sim too. Ooh, he is good looking too. Ooh, hello. Hello, Ravon. You can join our conversation all day long. Hello. 
Ravon. Oh, hi. Hey, Ravon. I feel like that's a raven. Like, like what was her boyfriend's name? Devon. What's going on, Devon? Oh my god. I'm pretty sure it was Devon was her boyfriend and that's a raven. Like, that's what, that's what he reminds me of right now. Let's go ahead and tell an engaging story. Do an inside. There's Malcolm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Look, I'm, I'm the center of attention. I'm a joke star. I'm going to change my profession. I'm not going to be a doctor anymore. No, screw, screw being a doctor. We want to be a comedian. We want, we want to be the next Bill Cosby. Boo. Yeah, that was horrible. No one wants to be Bill Cosby right now or ever from now on. But I like his hat, too. He's got some nice style. It's blue like her outfit, like literally blue and black. Like, oh, well, hi. Ha, <laughs> We're so funny. Yes. Hello. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, get to know him a little bit. Why not? It won't be a um that voice does not match that body but right now who cares javon we'll go ahead and ask if he's single he's a bookworm oh, he's smart too i mean with a name like that ravakumar like yeah you should be smart if not i should have to call your mother and ask her why the hell is your son not smart especially with a name like that go ahead and compliment his appearance screw zo he's single too i mean i can imagine with that voice but damn Damn, Javon. Hello to you. We need a boyfriend up in here, especially her, Miss. I'm a doctor. I can, I can cure. I got a, I got a case of, um, um. What's that song? Um, uh, um, um. Doctor, doctor, give me the news. I got a, a bad case of loving you. That's what we got right now. We got a bad case of loving you, Javon. Let's go ahead and buy a drink for Javon. Why not? Um. Order drinks for everyone. Let's get like the hardest, like most expensive one here. $54. So let's do a zebra fizz. Yeah. Going to flirt with him and then not compliment your outfit. We'll flirt. Oh, he did not like that. I'm sorry, Javon. Let's let's buy you a drink. Let's get you drunk a little bit. If you get drunk, you'll definitely want to talk to us. And she has to work in the morning, but you know what? Who cares right now? We are trying to get drunk and in this dude's pants. Like, this is what we got to do right now. That is what we got to do. We will order some drinks for everybody. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't make anything. No, no, no. Okay, I guess we're not going to order drinks. We're going to go ahead and order ourselves a zebra fizz. Why not? Get ourselves a drunk and start flirting like crazy. Well, Mr. Javon, I don't know where he went, but she's waiting for her drink. Who's this? Uh, I guess the new bartender is coming to work. I'm not sure. Um, Who are you? Oh, that's Drake. Let's go ahead and talk to Drake. We'll do a friendly introduction. Let's try to get to meet to know some people. She wants to call someone on the phone. We can call we can call Javon tomorrow. Tell a joke about aliens because they are existing in our games. I, I want to get someone um, freaking uh, abducted in this one. I have in my current house, my guy got abducted for the second time, you guys. So he is freaking pregnant with another alien baby. Like, it's so crazy but i did learn if you get seven um breakthroughs with the scientists you can actually go ahead and discover the um you can actually go ahead and discover the um um you can discover the satellite you can go ahead and actually make it and set it to not um you motherfucker that was our drink that was our drink, and you just took a freaking sip of it. Oh, Javon, hi, Javon. Javon, hi, did you come to talk to us? Oh, you're getting a drink, too? Oh, yeah, we have one drink for you. Definitely. Definitely for you. Let's, let's talk to Javon. Uh, make a flirtatious joke. <laughs> Put on the moves right now. Um, confess your attraction. Why not? Uh, ask about his day. Hopefully, you don't make a joke of yourself. Okay, it worked. Did work. Oh, and he's getting flirty. Come in appearance. Woo, 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 woo. We are moving on up in the world of love because we are Dr. Love. If you need a case, we are here to solve your love problems. And I am doing hand movements like y'all can see me when I'm talking to y'all. Oh my gosh. I'm getting really into this right now. Ooh. Javon's doing something to me. I don't know what it is, but hey, Javon. Um, she's a little focused. I mean, I love how you got a drink. And, um, no, um, Ray, Charles, we are not flirting with you. We are flirting with Javon. Oh, gossip a little bit. 
Um, compliment his appearance. <laughs> she's, she's waving from across the bar. Ooh, she is really into him. He is definitely going to be our first predator. Ooh, our prey. What are you going to call him? Zoe's still here? She's still hanging out with us? I'm surprised. We've totally given up on her for this dude. <laughs> like, Zoe? Hello, Zoe. Good or Goodbye, Zoe. Hello, Javon. I was going to do a risque question. She like it. Dude, no, we're not flirting with you. I'm flirting with him. Discuss interests. Um, flirt. And can we like invite him back to our house and like sleep with him? Um. Um. Can we travel back home? Let's go ahead and see if we can travel back home. Um, you're not gonna dance right now. Go ahead and flirt with him and then travel. I guess we'll go ahead and travel with. Let's see if Javon will come with us. Where is he? Javon. Let's go ahead and see if we can travel home with him. He's not busy. He's at the bar. Oh, he's um, he's an alien. You guys. He's an alien. Is he coming? Oh, and he's coming with us. Oh, my God. You guys, we just said we wanted an alien baby or something like that. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, guys. He's an alien. Did you not see him glowing? I will have to show you guys. We're going to go back home with him. Oh, my God. Dude, I know. Oh, my God. He's a freaking alien, you guys. Javon is an alien. I am almost 100% positive. He's a freaking alien. Oh, you guys have no idea how excited I just got right now. Oh, we may make this part a little bit longer just because of that. Like, oh, whew, whew, we're like, we're like racking up on almost a 30 minute video. Oh my God, you guys, he's a freaking alien. Like, pause. Is he glowing? He's not glowing. I'm pretty sure he's a freaking... Let's get to know him a little bit. Let's talk to him. Share insecurities. Um, reveal an invention. Like, he's a freaking alien, you guys. I'm telling you right now, he's an alien. He was freaking glowing green. He's self-assured, which is great. He's a bookworm and self-assured. Self Discuss interests. Share brilliant invention. Like, get over yourself right now. Self-deprecating joke. Like, literally, get over your miss. I'm so freaking bad at life. Thing. Um, y'all, like, what are y'all doing? Oh, y'all slept already? You guys are not gonna have a good day at work because y'all are sleeping. She hasn't yet, and she works in six hours. Literally six hours. Um, compliment Alpha. Let's try to get flirty with him a little bit. Uh, hug him. Uh, tell a dramatic story. Uh, share brilliant ideas. Like, he's, I'm telling you guys, he's a freaking alien. He is such a freaking alien, I'm telling you right now. Um, let's go ahead and romantic. Like, I don't care. We may have to call him to work today because of this. Um, more choices. Romantic. Uh, ask if single. He is single. We know this. Um, romantic. Uh, embrace a little bit. Let's see if he likes this. Romantic. Um, confess attraction. No, you're not going to sleep right now. You can wait. There's our teen. Like, I'm, every time he shows up, I'm going to like freaking do this. No. 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 No, 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 no. Gossip with him. Like, you can wait. You can sleep in a minute. I need you to be romantic with him. I need you to sleep with this alien, because I'm pretty sure he's an alien. Uh, embrace. Um, romantic. Confess attraction. Uh, more choices. Romantic. Pickup line. And he's not liking it. Okay. We screwed that up. There's always... Okay, there's always another time. You need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, you need to go to the bathroom and go to sleep because you actually need to work here in five hours and you're never going to make it to work on time. Oh my god, you're never going to make it to work on time. And it, off camera, I had these two woohoo a little bit, which is great. I thought you wanted to chat with Don. He's sleeping now, so you're kind of SOL in that. But I think we're going to go ahead and wrap up this part right here. Um, in the next part, we'll probably go ahead and I think we'll follow, I think we're following Lily to work tomorrow already again. Well, we're going to follow her to work. Um, and then maybe if we can get her and Javon, cause I'm pretty sure I'm like 
almost positive this is an alien. He was glowing green, you guys. I am pretty sure he's an alien, but we will do a lot more in the future and in the next episode. But for now, if you guys did like this video, go ahead and leave a like on it. And if you guys are new to my channel or if you have seen a couple of my other videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below because that means the whole world to me. And I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys.